Namaste. Welcome back to the Smart Library Solutions. Today, we're here with a tutorial on how to create and customize the MARC Bibliographic Framework in Koha 24.11, the backbone of library cataloging. If you've ever wondered how to customize MARC fields for different material types like books, articles, or videos, this tutorial is for you. What is MARC? MARC stands for Machine Readable Cataloging. It's a standardized format used by libraries to store and share bibliographic information, such as titles, authors, subjects, and more, in a way that computers can understand. MARC records are like digital index cards for library items. They contain structured fields that allow library systems, like Koha, to read, search, and display information accurately. Each MARC field includes Tags, for example, 100 for author, indicators, which control how the data is interpreted and displayed, and subfields, for example, $245A for the main title and $245B for the subtitle. Part 1. How to create the MARC Bibliographic Framework. Go to the Koha homepage, where all the modules are listed. Click Cataloging at the top right corner. Below the reports, look for Fast Cataloging. If you do not see the Fast Cataloging option, it means you didn't select the sample Mark 21 bibliographic framework during the Koha web installation. In that case, you need to create it manually. To create it, scroll to the bottom right corner and click Configuration under Administration of Cataloging. Then, click on Mark Bibliographic Frameworks. Click on New Framework. In the form, enter FA as the framework code. Enter Fast Cataloging as the description. Click the Submit button. You will now see the newly created framework listed as Fast Cataloging. Next, under the Actions column for the FA Fast Cataloging Framework, click Mark Structure. You will see the Mark Bibliographic Framework for FA. To create the structure using the default Mark 21 fields, click Use Default Framework and confirm by clicking OK. Now, go back to the cataloging homepage. Click on Fast Cataloging to start adding Mark records in Koha. You'll see many MARC fields organized under sections labeled 0 to 9. While some of these fields are useful, others may not be relevant to your library's needs. That's why we need to customize the framework accordingly. Part 2. How to customize the MARC Bibliographic Framework Step 1. Access MARC Structure. Go back to the Cataloging homepage. Click Configuration MARC Bibliographic Framework. Under the Actions column for the FA Fast Cataloging Framework, click MARC Structure. Step 2. Delete, ignore, or hide no mandatory mark. You have three options for handling no mandatory mark. Option 1. Delete, click delete in the actions column for no mandatory mark. Confirm the deletion of the tag by clicking yes, delete this tag. Option 2. Ignore, click view subfields in the actions column. Click edit. Under the managed in tab, select ignore and click save. Option 3. Hide, click view subfields in the actions column. Click edit. Under advanced constraints, go to the visibility section. Uncheck the editor checkbox. Click save changes. Step 3. Test changes in fast cataloging. Open the cataloging homepage in a new tab. Click fast cataloging to observe the customized mark fields in real time. Step 4. Reposition mark fields. Subject slash topic. To move a field, Subject 650 from tab 6 to tab 0 in the mark structure. Search for tag 650 using search for tag. Click view subfields, edit subfields. Select subfield dollar a under managed in, choose tab 0. Click save changes. Step 5. How to add a new mark tag. Click new tag on the mark bibliographic framework page. Fill in tag details. Tag mark number enter the mark field number. Description. Staff interface label for catalogers. Description. OPAC label for public display. Repeatable. Check if the field can be repeated. Mandatory. Check if the field must be filled. Click. Save changes to add the new tag. You will now see the newly created tag listed in the Mark Bibliographic Framework. Now, to add a subfield under the newly created tag 022, International Standard Serial Number Click. View subfields in the actions column of tag 022. You will see that no subfields are currently assigned. To add a subfield, click edit subfields. Fill in the subfield details. Subfield code. A description in staff interface. ISSN description in OPAC. 
ISSN repeatable. Since this field is not repeatable, leave the checkbox unchecked. Mandatory. Since this field is not mandatory, leave the checkbox unchecked. Important. Since this field is not marked as important, leave the checkbox unchecked. Managed in tab, select zero. Under advanced constraints, check the boxes for OPAC, staff interface, and editor under visibility. Click save changes. Finally, check fast cataloging to confirm that the customized mark subfield appears as expected. Part three, how to export and import the mark bibliographic framework exporting mark framework. Go back to the cataloging homepage. Click configuration mark bibliographic framework. Under the actions column for the FA fast cataloging framework, click export. You will see export fast cataloging framework. Make sure export to CSV spreadsheet is selected. Click export. The exported data will be downloaded to your system. Importing mark framework. Go to cataloging configuration mark bibliographic framework. Under the actions column, click import. Click choose file and upload the mark framework template. You can download a sample template from the tutorial description. Click OK to confirm the import. Now you're ready to add mark records in Koha. Thanks for watching. That's the end of this tutorial. See you in the next one.